Hello friends. In today's class, we will talk about computer system structure. We have already seen computer organization. Now we will see different stakeholder of computer system structure. Uh, welcome here and we are talking about here computer system structure. So what we have seen uh, just before this lecture was this hardware part. So we have seen this hardware part and we have seen that there are major parts here in this case is the CPU part and then there is a memory part and then there is an input output and then there is an interconnection bus. Okay. So here there are there are four uh, different uh, uh, four different stakeholder of a four uh, different stakeholder of this computer system stakeholder so a system is consists of four different parts and among here the top in the hierarchy is the user and user is the one who uses uses the computer for different purpose Okay. So each user may have a different purpose of using the computer. Then you have the next layer. Now you can think this as a layer that you have a system and application programs. Okay. So system program and application program is the next one. Okay. So now you have all the application over here. Here comes the operating system. The third layer is operating system. operating system now you can see here that operating system lies between the hardware this part and the system program part this part so immediately we will anyway we are going to define that operating system but you can think of it that operating system interact uh, acts as intermediary between intermediary between programs and programs is of two category programs and that category is your system or it can be an application program then we have a operating system so operating system is going to interact with system program and then finally operating system is going to interact with computer hardware so that can give you a very uh, let's say small definition of this computer system architecture. Now, the computer system is structured divided into the four different components. Uh, there is a hardware provide basic computing resource. Huh? This, is a, uh, this is a very good term, I would say that. It's provide computing resource, computing resource, okay. Then you have operating system. And now we are about to introduce this operating system and it what it does is it control and coordinate use of hardware among various application and user control and coordinate okay so that is an important term application program third uh, component is define a way in which the system resource are used to solve computing problems of the user so as i said that uh, user can have a different uh, uh, different set of uh, users having different set of requirement that i want to write a book i want to write a program i want to get some information i want to maintain large amount of the data or i want to have fun with the uh, playing some video games okay so that is your uh, the different categories of uh, you know application program can be users uh, the, the last one is the use the, the top one is the use uh, user sorry i was about to say loser sorry uh, users users are, are people and it can be machine or it can be any other computers okay so that is how our uh, this uh, this computer system structures look like and uh, we can say that will anyway I'll give you the definition but here we can say that this part control and coordinate use of hardware okay among various application and users okay so that's all for this discussion thank you